Hello everyone, welcome to the second part of the product animation series. Let's begin! Delete the floor and lights from previous scene. Scale the background twice. Move the background and lights closer to the bottles. Now select the left bottle and move it to the left. Select the right bottle and move it to the right by 5 points. Select everything and delete keyframes. Adjust the length of the timeline. Put start on frame 61 and put end on frame 200. Move up the right and left bottle by 7 points. Move the middle bottle down by 7 points. Insert keyframes for all bottles. Select middle bottle, go to last frame and put value 2 on the Z axis. Move the side bottles down and put value minus 2 on the Z axis for both of them. Select all bottles, right click on timeline and make the interpolation linear. Select the camera, go to first frame and move it back. Rotate on Y axis. Go to last frame, move the camera closer to the bottles and rotate on Y axis the opposite direction. Right click on timeline and change interpolation to linear. Now we should have something like this. Now add air light. Scale it to fit the bottle. Duplicate the light and position it in front of each bottle. Move and rotate the top lights to give the bottle nice shadow on edges. Now go to last frame and with auto keyframe on move the lights to the position of the bottles. Don't forget to change the interpolation to linear again to match the movement of the bottles. Turn on the cycles and set up the lights. On frame 80 add value 0 for the light and add keyframe. On frame 81 add value 600 on the light and add keyframe. Go to frame 121 and add value 600. On frame 120 put value 0 and add keyframe. Go to frame 160 and add value 0 for the next light. On frame 161 and value 600. Go to EV and preview the animation, you should have something like this. Lastly rotate the bottles. On first frame rotate the bottles by 45 degrees on Z axis and on last frame put the rotation back to 0 on Z axis. At the end, go to Shading and turn on Cycles. Select the background and turn down the metalness. Also bring up the roughness to make it brighter. Congrats! You just made it one step closer to the Epic Product Animation!